Some of the top ballers in the world are competing for millions of dollars in Baltimore. WMAR 2 News, Eddie Kadem has more on the TBT tournament that's going on at Morgan State University. Win or go home. And if you win, your squad takes $2 million with them. In its fifth year, the TBT tournament draws some of the best basketball talent in the world and their fans to Charm City. Basketball is a hotbed in Baltimore. Come bring a championship here, we'll turn out. Sure enough, last year we got the record attendance for our championship game and it was an easy decision to come back. International superstar Jimmer Ferdet is the leading scorer in the tournament. The basketball community is pretty small once you get at a pretty high level, so you play and compete against those guys all over the world. Uh, so it's been a, a lot of fun to be able to, to see everybody and to be a part of uh, some of my former BYU teammates as well. Hundreds turned out to see the stars compete in the nationally televised event. Seeing some of the players that I used to watch them in college, used to see them in the NBA, get back out here and compete against each other. Jerome Randall played college ball at Cal. He's excited to be playing back in the States after eight years overseas. Everybody want to play for money, but we know once we get between them lines, man, it's, it's very competitive, man. You know, everyone out here is trying to win the basketball game. Everyone, no one, no, no one wants to be, you know, embarrassed. You know what I'm saying? So it's about winning, you know, and obviously you get rewarded for winning. All the flair and ferocity you expect from a professional game, giving hope to young athletes that they could make a living playing someday too. I was seeing the spot like this. Hopefully one day I can get on a floor like this and get my shot on ESPN like some of these guys. At the TBT tournament at Morgan State University, Eddie Kadem, WMAR 2 News.